Hello, and welcome back to Crusader King 3. When we last left off, we played as High King Arpod Tarkatsutsi Tarkatsuts of the uh, Empire of Carpathia. And uh, we did that. We fully united Carpathia. We first we formed Carpathia, and then we united it under all Dijon lands. So if we go to Empires and what I control, I completely control Carpathia. So it's pretty good. We even control more land than Carpathia. And currently, I, when I last thought I was swaying this guy so I could vassalize him. We didn't die, so we're still the same person. But yeah, we are extremely close to vassalizing him. We just need to sway him one more time in two months. 61%, let's go. Okay, so, with this, I believe... Invite the court. Oh, that's his wife. <laughs> uh, yeah. Low feudal obligation. And with that, I grant you a kingdom. The kingdom of uh, Great Moravia. I hope you're happy. You, you have an entire kingdom. Pretty sure that is the entire kingdom. Like, yeah, that is the kingdom. It's two duchies. But that's not where this ends. I also want to give you Austria. Because why not? They're currently fine Sogami, I believe. Oh, Sogami's fine for that duchy right there. Slovene culture. Uh, I don't care, but I am increasing cultural acceptance among the Slovenes anyway. Um, we also, uh, changed our culture. We invited Christian settlements, and with that, our culture is now Hungarian. Instead of, uh, Moiger, which is what it was over here. Now the pitchings have control of that land. Uh, and, an important thing, the, uh, Khajarian, uh, the Khajarian Empire, the, Kuj the Empire of Khajaria collapsed. It's gone. So, that was, that's good. So, I'm pretty sure we are the dominant power in the region. After my invasions of Bulgaria, they've just been weakened beyond, like, just, yeah. I kind of want to vassalize these guys. We could try to. Not tribal if I would like like even like I could form an alliance to get rid of that not tribal modifier yeah fuck it we'll try to have a vassalize of Croatia I want to be able to form an alliance though well maybe they don't have a son if he gets a son we can do it because I have a daughter I can marry off mental break endless toil oh there we're also extremely wealthy. I can't spend this wealth on my capital because because my capital is uh, has a castle and I'm tribal. I can't do anything, so I need to become feudal, which is currently my goal. Nine years until barracks is done. So in 19 years, we will be able to become feudal. 19 years. But we do need absolute tribal authority on the march. Oh, search. Yeah, let's, let's be a part of that search. Okay, absolute ruckus. I don't want to have been in the search, so yeah. I can come up with a solution. Because I'm an engineer. Uh, that. And the search is over. And I get a perk. One, two, three. Right, 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 right. What do I need to change the crown authority? Oh, 1,100. I can get that. I my spouse died. God dang it. Oh, uh, I have prisoners that I can get rid of. Mind your daughter. Send for a physician. My champion has also been wounded. And your daughter didn't what was necessary. And I think she had a, the walls of heaves. See, I'll give them walls. Like, I can do anything with them. I'm fucking... But, yeah. Hmm. Right, let's call it a, let's call it a feast. Striking up prestige to increase our crown authority. 
That's your gathering. Okay. So let's just go by. Oh. Oh, what? Do we have split? All was the Dutch. No, all was down here. Nope. That. This is weird. This, should, this is weird. Do we own that now? It's all of. Uh, I don't get it. But we cannot have absolute travel authority, which is one of the things we need to become fuel. Now all we need is 70%. Like, that's literally all we need. How difficult is my capital? 14. Too bad it's pointless because, you know, since we're not feudal, it doesn't matter. It doesn't give any buffs. Ay, ay, ay. Listen, Croatia, if you become my vassal, then I will give you, I will create the... That's right, please. Yeah, because I don't have the king of creation to become the king of creation. I need a lot of counties. Now, there's these counties which I can just invade for. Which I should I? No, nah. maybe once we get Croatia, we'll invade them so Croatia can get their land. But for now, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. You know, wait. Not doing anything. Not invading. Like, I want this though. I don't like this border. I like I don't like weird borders. And this is a duchy anyway. Like this county is a duchy. I don't know why, but it is. My counselor died from wounds. Unfortunate. Okay, steward, marshal. My nation is pretty stable. I've stabilized everything since I became ruler. <laughs> like 30 years ago or something. Still sad that my fucking son died. Or one of my sons. However, his land was taken by my current son, so yeah. <clears throat> oh, I'm pretty, pretty happy with how big the empire is. strategist wonderful uh what's my second oh i'm only got a marital okay then we're just gonna do authority i kind of want to take back a till you know take a till because this is this is our ancestral homeland why do they make that their capital is that the capital of that kingdom or just your capital oh it is okay Interesting. Oh, they're fine. Moldavia right now. The Duchy of Moldavia specifically, not the Kingdom. Uh, let's throw them out. Who rule? Who owns land in Moldavia? Wait, what the fuck? Bro, what? Uh, seven M six soldier. So, bro, <laughs> the kingdom of Davia is here. Bro, that's insane. <laughs> that's insane. Can I declare soldier gauge war? I've already declared one. Oh, this guy has a claim to the kingdom. He died. I think he just died. I I, I think he just died. Curse him done. I don't know, just weird stuff happens. I could just take the entire kingdom of Zephyricia. That would be cool. Yeah, fuck, we'll do it. We'll take the kingdom of Zephyricia. Because why not? And then we'll capture, take a teal, and take a, the Yedison duchy. 
so we can truly have our ancestral homeland back. I can't have found a holy order. So I, I guess that's what I'm going to do. Uh, change its headquarters, though. City of Pest. I don't, I don't want to put anything in my capital because I want to develop my capital. Yeah, that city. Honestly, I might just invade. That's a tribal hold. Are these tribal holds? No, oh, that's a barony. That's a city. Yeah, fuck it. We'll invade them. Is there a bridge right here? There is right there. Okay. We're going to invade these guys. I should declare holy wars. Yeah. Oh, my wars. I'm not okay. I'll let you guys go then. I only because I don't think those guys are. Is your part of the kingdom? Yeah, they're part of the kingdom of Serbia, not uh, Croatia. Raise men at arms. I don't need anyone else. Too much. That's the thing. I took my foe. Andy, come on, Bruh. Alright, that's a bet. Whenever the Greeks, who are currently in a mega war, fucking unstable, but whenever the Greeks decide, oh, we want to take our desert land. And, you know, because, you know, if we go to empires, yeah, the Byzantine Empire is a pretty big empire. So whenever they decide they want to take what's theirs, they're going to invade you. And you're going to be ruled by a bunch of orthodoxes, and your rule isn't going to last long. It's not. Anyways, uh, with that, the Holy Order headquarters will be located in that city. Which I will then give to this person. Agree. Never mind. I'll keep it. I don't want it, actually. I'll give it to my son. It, it won't change the effect, but I just realized that would be better to give it to my son. Anyway, so let's educate my grandson. He's pensive. He's fucking motherfucker. Uh, let's do this. And great. Uh, ass. can I? Uh, pensive. Is pensive a uh, detriment? A detriment to a marital education? No, it's a detriment to intrigue. Well, I'm trying to educate you. In, I'm, I'm, I'm educating you in warfare now, son, because, yeah. Hey, we've, we've taken a, that. Thank you, Kuzerite. Hell no, change that faith. No. He's arrogant. Hmm, did I fight a war with him? Do I? I've been pretty lenient with uh, my treatment of non-Catholic vassals. I mean, th this is the last non-Catholic vassal, but he's sickly. He's probably gonna die. Yeah. Okay then. Well, I, I'm just I'm gonna keep uh, my uh, treatment of non-Catholics. This Jesus Christ, this guy's a fucking genius. Smartest man alive, and he's pensive. Jesus Christ, that's literally gonna be the smartest man alive. Uh, 12 and hard work. Uh, yes, hard work gets you a lot of places. Uh, convert. Okay, I'll let him practice his faith. How, how, what about the Catholic counties? Yeah, there's a lot of Catholic counties. As long as those aren't Catholics, those are Slavonskans. Hmm. Interesting. Oh well, uh, Zaphoricia. I don't have that claim to your kingdom no more. Oh well, I fight for the Duchy. Should I? It's a kid. It'd be an easy war. Uh, I can't declare. I could declare a holy war for a kingdom. But I need to become a paragon of virtue. Well, I know how to do that. I'm going to pilgrimage. To Jerusalem. 
very late in my life, but whatever. Adam's innocence, I was on part prepares to break camp. I noticed a massive, massive commotion nearby. A naked man has climbed on top of a large rock and is preaching to the assembled crowd. The original sin still stands our souls, stains our souls, my friends, but that need not be so. If we shed our garbs, we can recover the lost innocence of Adam and Eve. Then, only then, will the Holy Spirit see fit to touch us and show us God's true love. Oh, animantism. Oh, I want to... I'm in paint. No, I'm not. Right, anyways, get down. Just, just get down. What are you doing? Bandits, hell no. Let's go. I threw hands. And I walked the holy path. Great. How close am I to becoming a paragon of virtue? Ooh, really close. 300. Nice. Uh, let me host a feast. Because I'm a junker, I love me some feasting. A friendship, and now I'm friends with the Duke of Transylvania. Or High Chieftain. Because we're still tribal, but uh, we're slowly but surely advancing our way to feudalism. Oh, Croatia, let's find those guys. That's not Croatia, that's our vassal. That's not our vassal, that's... Well, it doesn't matter that war. Northman armies. What does that mean? Oh, they won. Oh, then be content. Now respect words. I'm not gonna be content. Again, I'm greedy. Content isn't what I do. Declaring a holy war on it. I guess it's just an excuse, right? First I thought joke, but how can my daughter and her uncle be lovers? Uh the world yes, yes, good, good. Anything to give me extra piety. Anything, really. Now I am one hundred and fifty away. I'm sixty two, but I'm also a drunkard, so I might die before I can even get that war off. But I'd rather that not be the case. That's a county? Well, they basically have this duchy right there, so they could just form that. Far from home. Uh, brace God. And I got stressed, I think. Yeah, my brother died. That's what they take. Isn't they take here? They take somewhere and I don't know. It's sad that my brother died. So, hard rule. The other factions haven't been an issue. I still find it weird that we have this land here. I don't know how will he show how my this is my brother. Yeah, I don't know how my brother got that land, but whatever. Marshall needs to go. <clears throat> Faith. Talks with? Oh. They also have Zealot. God dang it. Hide and peek. Lustful. I'm chased. I'm a chased. I don't like uh, sex. So, reclusive. Dang. I have three traits to help me with stress. God damn. Well, I guess I'm gonna seclude myself. Drink. And. Uh, I don't want to call it sweet, but it's pain. Average, so she should heal me. Should. I might. Doing that might have actually killed me, because I'm still injured. Yeah, I'm dying. Like, like beside my health is this heart near death. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm probably finna die. Come on, 60. God dang it. Can I declare the war before I die? Please, game. Come on, I believe in you. I believe in me. I can do it. Probably. Maybe. Nope. 
Hi, King Arpod of Carpathia has found peace in Christ and Brace at 65 years of age. He died from his wounds. A charming man, he became famous for his elaborate feast and grandiose balls. High King Tark Tarkat suits ascends to the throne. A charming and outgoing man, he is celebrated by many nobles across the realm as a gracious host. Because I'm a fat fuck. <laughs> and I'm at war with my own vassal. Oh my god. But, uh, but yeah, we will get into this in the next episode. Until then, I will see y'all. Like and sub if y'all enjoyed, and goodbye.